Hello everyone, I am Brianna and welcome or welcome back to my channel. As you guys can see from the title of the video, today I'm going to be doing a five spring outfits inspired by K-pop idols. The last time I did a K-pop fashion video was last year for Hobie's birthday and it's been a long time since then so I wanted to finally do another K-pop fashion video for you guys again today. This time I'm going to be doing outfits inspired by female idols from Blackpink, Red Velvet, Twice, and Luna so I'm super excited to show you guys the outfits. I will also be linking all of the pieces down below. In every outfit, there will be a piece, either a shirt, a sweater, or a dress that will have been actually worn by the idol in question. So I will be linking all those pieces down below. Thank you to Fashion Chimbu for sending me these pieces. I am super excited to be trying them on. They are so cute and let's get started. Okay, so the first outfit is going to be inspired by Wendy from Red Velvet. This is the top that I've actually already worn a bunch since I've got it. It is so cute. It has a little like ruching right here and it's a little bit cropped and I think I'm going to be pairing it with a plaid tennis skirt. It's just super soft and really cute and Wendy always has this very sweet, soft, feminine, girly style so I think it's perfect for the springtime. For the first outfit, I paired Wendy's white ruche top with this cute pleated tennis skirt. It is plaid. It gives me clueless era. 90s Britney Spears hit me baby one more time energy and I am in love with that aesthetic always have been always will be I decided to pair this outfit with some classic Doc Martens and some crew socks that say old school on the side I absolutely love this outfit. I think it's really fun The socks really pull it together in my opinion And I think it's really good just for a casual going out or hanging out with friends or even maybe going on a date If you want it to be a little bit spicy call back the 90s a little bit the second outfit is inspired by Joy, also from Red Velvet. She wore this hilarious sweater that says, my life is crap, with this lamb on it. And it was the funniest thing I've ever seen. I think Mama Moo Solar also wore this sweater. I laugh every time idols wear something that has something ridiculous in English on it. And it just, this I would wear every day. Um, my life is crap explains so much right now with life in quarantine. This just makes me laugh, I feel like. The cuteness paired with the words is great. It's great juxtaposition or whatever it is that people say when they evaluate art. I don't know, but this is the greatest thing in the world. I love it. Now this is what I like to call my I am falling apart and going through it, but I don't want people to know that I am going through it outfit. I decided to put on a skirt and a belt so I looked a little bit more put together than normal even though my sweater does in fact say my life is crap with a jumping lamb on it. I think this sweater is a work of art and I want everybody to see it and so I think I'm going to be wearing this with all kinds of outfits but today I paired it with some black booties and a brown suede skirt and a black belt. I think this outfit is really funny. I wore this out and so many people thought my sweater was hilarious and I also think it's hilarious and I'm really happy that it makes people smile. For the third outfit, I'm going to be wearing a dress that Luna's Yeojin also wore. It is a cute white lace dress with a little button detailing in the front. It's super soft, super sweet, super cute and youthful and refreshing just like Yeojin. She's so, so adorable and I can't wait to fit this into my wardrobe as well. It's the exact style that I like also and perfect for spring as always. So because springtime in the Bay Area is still quite windy, I paired this dress with a cardigan. This one here is a soft green color. I decided to try this button technique that I saw on TikTok where you button them incorrectly and it makes it look like it's a little bit ruched and I thought it was cute. I think it fits well with the dress and it's so breezy and light and cute. I paired it with my floral Doc Martin Mary Janes. I love these shoes. After the pain of breaking them in, I am glad that they look so cute with this outfit. I think I could see myself wearing this on a picnic date. For the fourth outfit, I have this cardigan that Dahyun from Twice wore. I really like Dahyun's fashion style a lot because I really like that she values comfort over all else. She always wears those really baggy pants and she wears outfits that I think look great on her. They're always really cute and fun but also super comfy and I feel like that's really something I value in clothing too. I mean obviously sometimes beauty is pain but I also like when beauty is comfort and this adorable cardigan is really soft and warm when it's a little bit windy in the spring so I think it'll be great to incorporate it into my wardrobe it just has you can see like the cute little floral details 
and the little I don't know what this is called piping I don't know I don't know fashion but it's it's super cute and the little tortoise shell button this outfit is truly an ode to Miss Dahin herself it is casual it is comfy and it is very cute just like she is I paired her cardigan unbuttoned over a simple red dress I think the pop of color is really fun and it matches the detailing on the cardigan it's perfect for again what I mentioned is a windy Bay Area springtime keeps you warm but not too hot perfect with these black buckle shoes that I paired with the outfit to bring a little bit of edge to what was otherwise a very soft look I love wearing this maybe into the city someday and just waltzing around in the park with my friends and the fifth and final outfit is inspired by none other than my fashion queen and love of my life Jenny Kim from Blackpink I am obsessed with everything that she wears this is a combo matching crop top and cardigan also cropped she wore this with I think a pair of black wide leg pants for an interview that Blackpink did and she looked amazing and I love that Jenny's fashion is very chic and stylish but also it's like it's cute but make it a little bit ho and I enjoy that aspect of her clothing and her style a lot because obviously this is very sweet and girly with the floral pattern and the light blue color but it's cropped so you get a little like spicy midriff in there if you would like now this outfit is a bit out of my regular comfort zone, but Miss Jenny Kim inspired me to embrace my inner fashion hoe. So there's a little bit of a spicy midriff action with this white tennis skirt and crop top combo. Here I am posing very awkwardly, please don't look at my hands. But I paired this outfit with my white Doc Martens. These are my new staple shoe. I wear them with every outfit and I think it is really cute with the rest of the fit. Again, brings a little bit of edge to the very girly outfit. Here it is in total. I am throwing up peace signs because I don't know what else to do with my hands. Let me show you guys some spicy shoulder. Wow. And that was the video. Thank you guys so much for watching and thank you again to Fashion Chingu for sending me these pieces to wear. I absolutely love them. Again, I will link all of the pieces down below for you guys to check out and I'll try to link everything that I wore, but some of these items are extremely old, so I'll try to find it on the internet as best as I can. Thank you guys again. I love you very much. Have a great rest of your day and I'll see you again next time. Bye.